Hey, what's up guys? Tim right here. I'm coming to you with a very, very quick unboxing of a beautiful Datejust. Now, this is a combination that you've probably seen before, but nonetheless, this is one stunning piece that should not be underestimated in the sea of hot steel sports watches. Let's get into it. Here is the watch, but before we get too far into the unboxing, let's steal a page from our good friend Oshin from the Timeless Watch channel and get a drink of whiskey. What I've got here is uh, a good viewer of the show, Mr. Real Cars and Chrono, has sent me a bottle of Lugavool in 16. Incredible stuff, as you can see. <laughs> I almost finished it, but... Let's get a small drink here. Here we go. Oh, just a little bit. I don't want to drink too much because I have to do a live show in a couple of minutes. Let's get that. Also, by the way, I'm wearing the Speedmaster 3861. Mm. Ah, a video on this watch is coming very soon. This is the one that the community has pulled pulled money together and gifted me. Beautiful, beautiful piece. But let's do the unboxing. Here we go. Here is the watch that this gentleman has picked up. Let's see what it is. As you can see, this is a Datejust 41. It's got this protector on it. Let's take it off. Beautiful Datejust 41. Wimbledon dial, smooth bezel, and oyster bracelet. An absolutely stunning, stunning combination. Let me take this off. And let me put down a bit of a, there we go, let's place it here. I'm going to take off, take off the speedy. I need to get the tools to resize the bracelet. Look at that. Now, obviously, this is not going to be the watch that most people would be going after. This is, uh, you know, a very, very unique piece. Wimbledon dial has never, you know, has never been very, very popular because it's a acquired taste. But it is stunning. It's a dial first watch. You know, the attention to detail is just perfect. You know, they, they make this dial also with batons and rhodium. I think I have some images in my uh, on my Instagram which is Tim Wright on Instagram you know right now there is this whole craze after steel sports steel sports it people want steel sports or nothing but I think the stuff is just overhyped guys it's overhyped it's completely unnecessary let me show you something let's put this on the wrist for a bit of a better look what a, actually it's a little bit tight the whole package just comes together and alive the polishing on the center links the polishing on the bezel the smooth flat bezel i prefer this type of smooth bezel over the smooth bezel on the 36 i don't i'm not a huge fan of the dome but this this bezel it just works look at the curvature of the of the date chest Unlike Submariners, which have hard edges, the Datejust, with its curves and smooth polishing on the, on the sides, wears like a glove. It's just smooth and perfect. Oh, and let's not forget the Easy Link. As you can see underneath here, it's got this Easy Link function that you can push in like that and make the brace shorter now it's going to be even tighter okay now to make it longer you just pull and it pops out 
very very classy the way they did this easy link it's just genius and Rolex Rolex have really outdone themselves it's got as you can see on the clasp it's got the applied Rolex logo the polishing throughout wow a bit of brushing on the sides I mean this is just a piece that screams pure claws pure claws as you can probably know the movement absolute workhorse w what can you ask for it's three days power reserve 72 hours quick change date you can quickly change it the hands very quick very easy watch to use this is a watch for someone who wants just a piece to go through life with. Absolutely no complaints. Guys, thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed this little unboxing, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, enter my giveaways, and uh, watch the live shows. Watch the live shows. Take care, guys.